Okay, so I called the Hilton Honors phone number, and because I've checked into the hotel and I'm here, they can't help me. I gotta go downstairs. Not feeling good about that. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Okay. So I travel a lot for work. I don't know if you guys have figured that out. Get it on, even in, in my new world. Okay, that's not why I'm doing this. I'm staying at a, at a uh, Hilton Homes 2 in uh, Knoxville, Tennessee. And, um, you know, in most cases, I'm pretty, like, I'll look past things, right? Like when there's clearly some dirty stuff, when there's issues in the room, and I'm just kind of like... Well, whatever, people staying here, not that big. Okay, all right, but today, today's visit, today's visit is, is a little gross. I'm gonna show you some stuff, all right? Hilton, you should know, Knoxville is not living up to the Hilton standard. Here we go. So first thing I noticed were like these stains on these curtains, not, not a big deal. Like kids stay in these rooms, so things are gonna, things are gonna happen. I don't know if you can see, yeah, you can see that. Something has spilled all over this. Like something has been thrown. That's not clean. I wiped off like dog hair. Here's here's something else. There's another, that, that actually looks like that might have come from somebody's, between someone's legs. And like TV has been wiped down, but it's like, it's it's got this trail of, dirtiness. So you can kind of see it on the left side there. Um, and like, dude, the walls, like, oh, this is, this is pretty bad. Like, pretty bad. And I found some hair up here, too. Um, but I have since pushed it down onto the ground. If I could find it, I, oh, there's one right there. There's another hair. Just sitting there. You can see, like, drips all over this. Which is understandable, right? Because this is a sink. You're gonna wash your hands, water's gonna drop. You can see that they're they're not using the standard stainless steel. <laughs> stainless, wrong. And like the door, there's like shit all over the door. This is gross, I don't even know. Like, when was the last time this was clean? See this shit, like what, what is this? And the bathroom, well, There's a long hair there. There's hair there. Right. Fingerprints and stuff all over this door. It's kind of gross. I don't know what this, like white stuff. Look, people leave doors open. They use hairspray. This is gross. It's like shit. I, it just looks like someone took like a towel and just wiped all this stuff down. And that's the thing is like, especially since COVID, like people want to feel like the hotel's taken care of. Hi, oh, he, see that metal bracket right there? It's supposed to have this lamp on it. <laughs> it doesn't. Oh yeah, like if I put my finger in there, am I gonna get electrocuted? What's going on here? <laughs> but, uh, <sighs> it, I'm pretty sure there's a pee stain somewhere on the carpets right here. I don't know, you can see that circle. Anyway, uh, traveling. There's things that you can expect. Things are gonna happen and it's not the end of the world. I'm pretty lenient when it comes to stuff like this. I will say that uh, I do feel incredibly spoiled um, when we go to Disney properties. Like we never encounter, never say never. I mean, there's times where it's like, oh, this kind of seems a little off for Disney. But Hilton usually does a good job. I haven't been a... Uh, Hilton Honors a Diamond member for five years, going on six years. That's how that happens, it progresses. If it was five, the next one is six. Okay, glad we got that, that out of the way. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, this is disappointing. And I'm here for three nights. Oh, look, I found this on the bed. That's gross. Anyway. That's a disappointment. How are you? Are you good? Everything's good? All right, good. I'm gonna start vlogging from some of the hotels that I stay in because this is this is typically like when we're not uploading content, it's it's because I'm traveling. I'm gone for work, I'm I'm doing what I do 
in my uh in as 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 a slave to the cabal <laughs> sorry I'm kidding but this is what this is what um this is what I might start doing if you appreciate this if you like this kind of stuff uh then let me know and if you're responsible for any of these marks on these walls shame on you knock it off okay i'm going to poop i got to poop 3 hours later so i showed you those and I just discovered this one. Like, what the hell? Uh, oh my gosh. At what point would you ask to be moved to another room? Like, I'm, I'm pretty grossed out. Yeah. Uh, again, sink. Ah, uh, man. I hope somebody, I hope a social media director, somebody reaches out <laughs> and asks me to take this video down because uh, uh, this is not a good reflection. This is bad. And look, I, again, I prefer Hilton Hotels. And I stay, a lot, I stay at a lot of Marriott Hotels, too. And I've had issues at both. When you travel as much as I do, uh, it's going to happen. But this is, um, in the fridge, can you tell? There's like streaks. I did check the bed. <laughs> and the bed is clean. Except for the bed I'm not sleeping on, which has that stain I showed you guys. But, uh, yeah, I left it down low and everything. <laughs> it's just... Okay, guess I better turn in for the night. We'll see if I, see if anything bites me. Yeah, won't that be fun? Holy shit. <laughs> I came um, to take a shower before bed and um, you may have noticed earlier that the curtain was shut so I pulled it over and found that sitting up there fucking gross fucking gross okay so I called the Hilton Honors phone number and because I've checked into the hotel and I'm here, they can't help me. I gotta go downstairs. Not feeling good about that. Um, but after finding that washcloth up there, I'm out. I'm not staying. Uh, so I called the Hilton Honors number, told them what happened and that I want to uh, be moved to a different hotel. And they were like, we can't help you. You're gonna have to go downstairs. And, uh, and uh, sorry, reading a text there. And, um, and deal with the manager down there. So I'm gonna go down there and I'll update you guys, all right? Oh, that's nice. So there were guys out here working, uh, replacing these lights. And so like I expect to see like the trash and stuff on the floor, I guess, because I'm sure nobody's available to uh, I'm going to go talk to management. So my, I'm in another hotel. This is a uh, Hilton Garden Inn. And uh, let me tell you what happened at the last hotel before I tell you about this, this experience here. Um, the last hotel, I did speak to the manager downstairs. Extremely helpful. Great guy. In fact, um, I, I won't share his name because I, I, I don't assume he would like to... Uh, to know that if you're with Hilton and you're curious to know, you can send us a message. He was fantastic. He handled it like a pro. He even asked me to send him some pictures because he'd like to review that. In his, in his opinion, he thinks the room was partially cleaned. It wasn't actually ready for uh, a patron to uh, a patron. That's a strange word for me to use. Was not ready for somebody to come in and use. So, um, 
Hold on, let me take my sweater off. It's, it's, it's warmer in here than it is the other hotel. So uh, they wiped the, the bill, they reimbursed the bill, um, did not have another room to move me in. So uh, I was like, listen, I, thank you. Just let's cancel everything. He confirmed the card, said he's gonna put everything on the card. And I uh, had a choice to go to the, an embassy suites, which was gonna cost another 40, $45 a night. Uh, or here at um, the, I wanna tell you exactly which one I'm at. I wanna share this because I'm having, I, I've had an incredible experience already. So this is a Hilton Garden Inn and uh, it's on the west side of town. And uh, as you can see, the room is pretty cool. There's, there's some exposure to some, uh... <laughs> must be something about this town, man. So these cables, it's because of this, this piece, I can't shut it. This video is gonna give Hilton a bad name. Hold on. There's a lady here who is an absolute sweetheart. Her name is Sharon. And um, I walked in the door and she just had an amazing uh, vibe, aura, uh, just this, the kindest eyes. And uh, I walked up and I said, hey, I was over at the homes too, and I left that hotel, I'm over here. I just booked it, and I was trying to get the digital key to come up on my, my phone, and I couldn't. I told, I gave my last name, and she was like, oh, uh, Scott, like knew right away. And I was like, yep, that's me. And she's like, well, I'm so glad you're here. And we just had one of the greatest conversations. She talked to me, she said, I've got, I've got this look about me <laughs> that apparently says something about me being a, a rocker, uh, but, uh, yeah, she's right about that. Um, but um, already feeling much better about this room. It's nice, it's bright. And maybe the other room was not as bright because the intention was to hide stuff. But uh, the hotel itself, as soon as you walk in, so much cleaner. And here's the reason why I booked over at the other place is because it's got never coming to Knoxville. I look at the ratings and it had uh, 4.5 out of five. And this had a 4.5 out of five but I chose that one because typically those rooms are bigger, but this this is nice and uh, this is so much cleaner. So if you have the choice and you're coming to the area, come to this hotel, okay? Not that I'm selling this, but just sharing another experience with you guys. Uh, so anyway, all is good. Um, she even tried to get me in a room with a king bed, but she said uh, it won't be available till tomorrow. If I wanna make the switch, I'm good. I don't need that. I'm gonna iron my clothes, hang them, and call it a night. But uh, yeah, Sharon is awesome. She's a sweetheart. And uh, you know, we even got, we even talked a little bit about negative people. And if you've watched our vlogs for a long time, then you have seen how I feel about negative people. And she said, they just need our love. And I love that. So anyway, okay, okay, oh. And right out my door, there, there's, check this out. I've never seen this before. How cool is this? This is a total Nashville vibe. Oh my God, love it. Come outside, got the other patio here. You can just chill out. Some rooms right there, we can just hang out. Have some fun. <laughs> no smoking? Oh, okay, inside. <laughs> anyway. Uh, good to know. I will definitely, definitely be hanging out at this hotel every time I come here. And that's because of the customer service that Sharon provided. And uh, and that helps with the overall vibe. The, the other manager at the other hotel, great, total pro, handled everything. Unfortunately, the situation was a situation. I'm glad that they handled it the way that they did because ultimately, listen, things happen, right? Anytime you're dealing with uh, humans, you deal with the human error uh, factor, right? And so things happen. I'm not gonna get high and mighty and disappointed about it. It just is what it is. And I feel like I was treated right and Hilton continues to, they will continue to yield my service, so. And especially Sharon. Wait, I will always come back and play. It all. Okay.
Okay, see? It closed. Everything's fine. We're all good. Okay, good night.